guess who's back? Back again. Yes, time for another plush collection. I'm pretty sure everyone knows the drill already. I always do plush collections each year. So this is the Mario plush collection for 2022. So obviously, if you saw my what I got for Christmas 2021 video, you'll know that I got tons of plushies. So yeah, I ended up getting tons of plushies today. Well, not today, but for Christmas. So yeah, we're gonna start off with the plush collection for this year because I always do them in Mario plush collections for each year and wait, this, what's the hat doing here? This hat is not even a plush. So, yeah, okay. So, yeah, we're gonna start the plush collection already. Let's get into it. So let's snap our fingers, start the plush collection. So yeah, um, I'm just not, I'm not gonna like explain what the plushie is, cause if I, if I were to explain like, um, wh where I got it and the detail on it, it will probably take forever. And this video is probably gonna be so long, so I'm not gonna explain them. I'm just gonna show them to you. So yeah, let's get started with the Mario's. So now, so yeah, we're gonna start off with the Mario's. So yeah, I'm gonna go and explain all the Mario's right away because you know this video will probably be so long. So the first Mario I own is my original All Stars Mario. And once again, I'm not really gonna explain the plush. So yeah, I'm just gonna show them to like for three seconds. So here's the original All Star Mario. Um, the my one of my newer All Star Marios, the one I now use in my videos, that I will eventually we we replace pretty soon, because that Mario over there is a legend. Um, another All Stars Mario. So in total, I have three All Star Marios. Um, this really dumb looking Mario because it's really dumb. Um, the face looks so weird. Um, medium sized good stuff Mario. Um, so yeah, this was, you can find these at arcades whenever you want. Um, wor World of Nintendo Mario made by Jack Specific. Um, this... It's kind of chunky, yeah, but not really. Um, I got this from Target. Um, this big Mario that I honestly don't know which company made or when I got this. But all I know is that the big Mario is probably one of the first Mario plushies I've ever owned. And speaking of big, here's this Mario hat pillow made by Tomi Club Machi Machi. So yeah, this is very huge. Um, so... Well, um, this is technically not really a plush, but to me it counts as a plush. This is the Mario sponge that was, like, used a few, for a few, like, minutes, for a minute in the Lego Mario curse. You probably saw this, so yeah, um, this really counts as a plush. Um, I got three baby Marios. The World of Nintendo baby Mario. The Sane baby Mario that I use in my videos. And the All-Star Baby Mario, so yeah. Here is Mario riding Yoshi. Um, this is one of those plushies that I think was a great concept. Concept Because you can have this... <laughs> reminds me of Super Mario World. Because, you know, that's the first game Yoshi was in. Um, and here's the 8-bit Mario made by Jack Specific. So you know what, he can go like... Or not like that. I'm, I'm just a crazy YouTuber. Here's my old Fire Mario, and he's, of course you can tell, he's very old. And then I got the All-Stars Fire Mario, so yeah. This is probably much better than this one, but I still like this one, because this is one of my childhood Mario plushies. And, oh, I almost hit the wall or something. But then I also got this Tanuki Mario from Super Mario 3D Land. Um, the tail is very nice. So yeah, you can wiggle this tail around, because... No one will care, pretty much. I mean, I don't know. Um, this is the Cat Mario that, um, the Cat Mario from Super Mario 3D World. You know, like, 
But let's say if you want to play Bowser's Fury and you ended up getting the that big cat bell. Okay, you got this big good stuff cat Mario that I got from Dave and Buster's that I used my tickets on. So yes, this was this was worth tickets. I think if they sell this on eBay, it'll be so expensive because I don't want to waste money on expensive stuff. But I'm still hoping I can get that Mario Party 5 Luigi. Here's the World of Nintendo Metal Mario next to with the All-Stars Metal Mario. So yeah, this one is obviously a bit better than this one, but this one is pretty much rarer than this one, so yeah. Because the World of Nintendo one is a bit older. Here's a Flying Squirrel Mario, and you can make him fly around. Mm -hmm. Wait, this is in Galaxy. Here's a Builder Mario from Super Mario Maker 2. Um, this one's very nice, and I also have a Builder Luigi that I will show you in this video. Um, but I also have one of the more recent plushies. Here's the All Stars, well, not All Stars, the Santa Dr. Mario. Um, back in the day, many plush channels used a custom Dr. Mario, but I don't know how to customize stuff, so I waited for a Dr. Mario plush to happen, and it happened. So, yeah, the pill looks very nice, and everything looks nice on it, so yeah. And the last few Mario plushies are the three Super Mario Odyssey ones. Here is the normal Mario Odyssey one next to the Cappy hat. Not the hat I threw off of the bed. So yeah, um, so yeah, I were, I'm, I'm planning to make a Mario Odyssey series. So yeah, expect this to be in future videos. And, up, oh, drop the hat. And speaking of that, here's Cappy that is n it's not turned into Mario's hat, so yeah, um, Cappy here looks very nice, I gotta say, so yeah, um, Cappy is pretty cool, I'm, I'm a diehard Cappy fan, don't ask. And then I got the beautiful wedding Mario, look at this hat, look at this, this, this bow tie, look at everything on it, it's so beautiful, recommend these Mario Aussie plushies. And this wedding Mario, you will definitely not want to destroy. Do not even think about destroying this wedding Mario. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. I'm calming myself down now because, once again, I'm crazy YouTuber. So today, we're gonna move on to the Luigi category. Because Luigi's always the number one. Yes, Luigi's always the number one. Okay. Okay, so starting off with the Luigi's, we have the one and only, the All-Stars Luigi that you see in almost every single video. Well, not almost every single video. Back then, I always used Luigi in every single video, but now he's in less videos, so yeah. We got Luigi here, and everything about him is beautiful. And, and, and he was so beautiful, I ended up buying another All-Stars Luigi that will be, t uh, will be used in the video where Mario and Luigi cloned themselves, but and then I will try to customize this Luigi into, like, Mr. L from Super Paper Mario or Dr. Luigi, because I want to give Dr. Mario his own special brother. Then I got the... Oh, I dropped him. We got the World of Nintendo Luigi. Um, so, yeah. Um, this is similar to the World of Nintendo Mario, and World of Nintendo Luigi has a long head. Because Luigi's long. But this Luigi does not have a long head because it's another fake Luigi. Look at this one. Just... Oh my gosh. Just... I don't know. Just... Look at this face. This is not good. Do, do do Chinese people make these plushies? Because, oh, they do a terrible job. Anyways, here is the medium-sized good stuff Luigi, which looks very good. Much better than the boot-like one. Um, this, um, Luigi, um, pretty cute overall. The mustache is nice. Um, everything about this face, everything about Luigi plushies are amazing. Um... Here's, um, this, um, I can't try to, alright, a big Luigi hat pillow, and with a small Luigi hat pillow, well, this is not a pillow, it's small, so yeah, um, so yeah, we got these two Luigi hats, this is his son, and this is his, his father, so yeah, I'm just gonna throw his father and the son, now, now you can't see his kids, so yeah. But then we got three baby Luigi's, just like the baby Mario's, they're from the same set. The World of Nintendo baby Luigi, the Santa baby Luigi, and the All-Stars baby Luigi. So, here you have three baby Luigi's. So, yes. 
here's the Luigi riding yellow Yoshi. Um, once again, this is reminding me of Super Mario World. And this is another one of these plushies I got for Christmas. Luigi holding a question mark block. So you could put whatever you want in the question mark block. So imagine if you want to put Minecraft Steve in here. Now you can. So yeah, you could put whatever you want in here. And if you want Luigi to be scared, you can make this like happen like, Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I can't see anything. Oh, I can't see. Um, oh. Ugh. And now we're taking out Minecraft Steve. Because Minecraft is epic. And then we have the power of Luigi plushie. But before I show you that, here's the hashtag collectibles Luigi puppet. Um, I don't think I ever showed you this, but this Luigi puppet is pretty funny looking. So, yeah. Um, Hello, guys. I'm Luigi, and I finally realized you have to put your thumb, thumb in the hands to make his arms work. So yeah, um, yeah. So I'm Luigi, guys. Today we're singing a song. Someday we'll find it, the Rainbow Connection. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm so cringy. Um, here's the old Fire Luigi, and here's my new Fire Luigi. Um, these both two Fire Luigis, old and new. So yeah. And when I say I can I show them for a few seconds, I'm not joking. So you really, if you want to see more of the plush, you can slow down the video if you want. So here's the Kitsune Luigi from Super Mario 3 Land. Um, this looks again, I say this many times, looks like Tails from Sonic the Hedgehog. So yeah. Um, here's the Cat Luigi from Super Mario 3 World. Still don't know why there's dots all over him. And then there's the Squirrel Luigi that makes him fly. Squirrel Luigi finally got his own brother, which is so amazing because after a year, Squirrel Luigi finally has a brother. And here's the Builder Luigi from Super Mario Maker 2. Now everyone, um, like this video if you want a Dr. Luigi plush to happen because I definitely want one to happen, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to happen because, you know, Dr. Mario World discontinued! No, But anyways, it's okay, because you, you know, I mean, just watch footage from YouTube. But then we got two Luigi's Mansion plushies. The Scared Luigi from Luigi's Mansion, honestly, one of my favorite plushies I owned. I definitely love the look on Luigi's face, that just makes this plush like... This plush looks like a box office. It should have a... This plush should own... Should have... Half billion copies of these plushies owned. This plush should have a billion dollars. Beautiful. This plush should be like worth a lot for Avengers Endgame. And I'm just making funny memes. But then we got Polter Pup, which honestly is so nice because Polter Pup is so cute. Because I barely just, yeah, so, so yeah, we got two Luigi's Mansion plushies. Don't know when I'm gonna get the regular Luigi because I will do that eventually. Because I would like to make a Luigi's Mansion series this year. Stay tuned for that. And now we're gonna move on to Toad. Now let's move on to Toad. So we got Goldie Toad. Um, the Goldie Toad, famously used by one of the most popular channels, plus channels that I honestly don't feel like we need to explain. Here's the Blue Toad, the All Stars one, um, the Santa Yellow Toad. We got Blue Toad and we got Yellow Toad. So yeah. And then we got the last Toad plush, Captain Toad. So yeah, Captain Toad is amazing. He's got his bag. He has um, his cape. Not this thing. I don't know what that is. His light. Everything about this plush is amazing. I really want to get the other one where he's like standing and he's holding like a vegetable. And uh, that thing. I don't know what it looks like. Yeah, so now we're going to show you the princesses, which I have. Princess Peach, the original Princess Peach I use in my videos. Um, Baby Peach, I really want to get Baby Daisy and Baby Ro- oh, I dropped it. I really want to get Baby Daisy and Baby Rosalina, so yeah. Um, so, then I got Princess Daisy and Princess Rosalina. I know Rosalina's not really a princess, yeah. But yeah, so, I definitely want to get Baby Rosalina, Baby Daisy, and Cat Rosalina. Don't ask why a Cat Rosalina plush exists. I did not make the plushies. They were made by Sane. Shout out to them. If they are going to watch this video, because they're probably not. 
but yeah. This is pretty much a short section, so I'm gonna get this one over with. Here is the good stuff Donkey Kong right here, and here's the All Stars Diddy Con. So yeah, I got Donkey Kong and Diddy Con. Oh no. <gasps> what is this? Donkey Kong has some problems. I need to go fix him. His issue is completed, so yeah. Donkey Kong has hair now, so this is Donkey Kong's hair. If you ever come to my house, you're probably gonna find Donkey Kong's hair, so... Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm... You, no, seriously. Donkey Kong's hair. But Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong are thrown over there. Now, let's move on to the Yoshis, because there's a ton of Yoshis. Now, we're starting with the Yoshi section. So, first off is the Gold Yoshi. Um, probably one of the first Yoshis I've ever owned. Um, he's pretty old. Um, when was this... When was this plush maiden? I, I don't know where the tag is. Yep, I don't know when this plush was made, so yeah, I'm gonna say this was probably made in 2011 or 2012. So, yeah. Um, then we got two medium-sized Good Stuff Yoshis. Yeah, this one and this one, both from Dave & Buster's. Then we have the All-Stars Yoshi, which honestly looks very nice. Um, the All-Star ones are in this same position. While, like, take, like, Sané plushies like this, their legs are a bit shorter than this. So, yeah, there's the All-Stars Yoshi. Then we got two Build-A-Bear Yoshis. This one literally has no clothes because it used to have clothes, but then we took it off. And then we got the Build-A-Bear Yoshi with the Super Mario hoodie on it. So, yeah. You're gonna put his hoodie up, and now Yoshi looks like them high school students. Uh, mm, can't throw them. Um, but yeah. Um, but then we got. Where are we? One you literally this Yoshi egg pillow that you literally can use this in an Indiana Jones style way. So yeah, it's, this is. Uh, so imagine if you take like this, and this is Indiana Jones, like. <sighs> You got squished. Rip Red Yoshi. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the Red Yoshi because here's the Sané Red Yoshi. Um, here's the Sané Orange Yoshi. Orange Yoshi is probably the least common like color Yoshi. Least common. Least common Yoshis exist. Yeah, that's probably what all of you are gonna say. The light blue Yoshi from the All Star set. All Stars blue Yoshi. Um, World of Nintendo Blue Yoshi. Um, so yeah. Um, All Stars Purple Yoshi with a Club Mochi Mochi Purple Yoshi egg. Um, All Stars Pink Yoshi. All Stars White Yoshi. This fake White Yoshi. So you know what? It's stupid. But then we got the All Stars Black Yoshi, which is honestly pretty cool. Um, don't remind me of Black Yoshi, because, I don't know. But anyways, um, but then I have, uh, but then here are two more Yoshi plushies. This one is pretty famous, not really, because I'm not famous, but here we got the hashtag collectibles Yoshi puppet, aka Poshi, because, you know, I can make him like, Hey guys, it's me, Poshi, because, yeah. I wonder if he can wear the hat I'm wearing right now. Yeah, it's a perfect fit. 10 out of 10. Um, yeah, so yeah, I'm putting my hat back on. So yeah, um, so yeah, if you ever want to use a Yoshi puppet, this is probably the only option you have. So yeah. Then I got one of the other plushies I got for Christmas, Poochie, which is counting in the post -yo Yoshi section because he is from Yoshi games. So yeah, um, po Poochie can probably flip the screen because, I don't know. Because, yeah, um, so yeah, um, Poochie is pretty adorable. So yeah, now we're gonna move on to the Wanyo and Wanuigi section, because Wanyo and Wanuigi are epic. So here we have the all, not all stars again, um, this is the Sané Wario that is, has a fallen, the fallen hat. Then we got all stars Wario, which is so fat. Look at how fat he is. So yeah, Wario's this 
Wario's fat. Goodness, man, Wario's definitely fat. That baby Wario, baby Wario is obviously fake, so yeah, um, baby Wario's pretty stupid. Now we got three Wanoigis. Um, don't ask me why I got a fake Waluigi. Um, I randomly got this, so yeah, you could definitely tell it's kind of fake. I don't really know if this is fake or not, but I don't really know. Just, um, the tag. This tag says Hudson Soft. So yeah, when some tag says Hudson Soft, you're probably gonna get confused if this is real or not, but I think this is fake. So yeah. But then we got this. DNA Wanoigi, the first Wanoigi I've ever owned, because Wanoigi's epic, so this is a Sane Waluigi, and then we got the All-Stars Wanoigi, and now, you're an All-Star, get your wear on, go play, and now, you're an uh, Okay, um, I'm, uh, you know what, uh, oh my god, I'm gonna get copyright print. Moving on to the Bowser section, so here is, um, Bowser, the All-Stars one, the All-Star Bowser, because this Bowser is, like, so amazing. I, I love this Bowser so much. This Bowser is probably one of the best Bowser plushies I've ever owned. More better than the Mario Party 5 Bowser. And now, I said that, people are gonna be like, No, the Mario Party 5 Bowser is way more better than that. Uh oh. I don't care, because that's the only Bowser I could ever own and ever buy for a fortune. So, yeah. And now I'm gonna calm myself down, because we got a Bowser shell that I also got for Christmas. So yeah, Bowser shell, um, I don't know if this is supposed to be where Bowser pokes his head out. But yeah, um, I could throw this on the wall. So yeah, Bowser shell. And then we got the all-star Bowser Jr. Um, this Bowser Jr. is like, um, I wish I got the city one, but I might get the, I might get the city one eventually, and then I can replace that with this one. Don't get me wrong, I like this Bowser Jr., but it's not really the perfect size for a Bowser Jr. Like, you get, he's probably almost the same size as that Bowser over there, but probably not. And then we got... Dry Bowser. The fake Dry Bowser. I really want to get the real one. I will eventually get the real one, I just am too lazy to buy plushies, so yeah, this is the fake Dry Bowser. But then we got... King Koopa. Now, you're probably gonna be like, who the heck is King Koopa? Well, if you weren't born in the 80s, and if you don't know what the Super Mario Bros. Super Show is, you probably don't know what King Koopa is. But if you watch the Super Mario Bros. Super Show, like I do, you probably have seen this guy before, and he's no longer, like, ever in Mario games or anything Mario related. So yeah, this plush will keep you reminded of King Koopa. And now we're going to move on to the people in, because we're going to go in order of how they are. So, here is, um, Larry, um, Roy, with his sunglasses, um, um, I can't, I can't, those are falling out of my hands. Lemmy, Lemmy Koopa, one of my favorite Koopa lanes, and Lemmy's probably my favorite Koopa lane. Um, Wendy, um, probably one of my least favorite Koopa lanes, because... What's with those lips, Wendy? What? Are you just... You have big lips. I don't know, but... Here's Iggy, with his crazy hair. He's so crazy. Um, and then we got Morton, which... This Morton's the only Koopaling that is not to be real licensed by Nintendo. This is another bootleg. But then we got Ludwig, with his big blue hair. It's Ludwig van Beethoven. He's gonna sing a song. I hope you guys are liking the jokes because I hope no one calls them cringy. Because I try not to cringe many people, but I just try to make funny jokes, okay? Jokes, funny things, is what I always want to do for my audience. Just like you if you're watching this video. And now I'm gonna stop the joke because. We're gonna move on to the items. And so, there's so many new items I got for, from Christmas that the item section is way more bigger now. So here we have a question mark block that is not the, the one that Luigi's holding, but this one is like a zipper, so you can put many things like Minecraft Steve. Let's get Minecraft Steve again. So imagine putting Minecraft Steve in here and keeping them close. 
And yes, yeah, so get out of Minecraft seat. You're not going into question mark block no more. No. You're now gonna go into the warp pipe. But in all serious though, this is a this warp pipe is some plush I really wanted because it's gonna be useful for many videos and I can't wait to show you this warp pipe in more videos. So we're gonna put I'm just gonna throw the Steve in here and Steve is gonna come out. Come out Steve. Yay! And like this video for Minecraft Steve because Minecraft Steve wants you to like this video. So yeah. I'm gonna throw this plush because that plush is made out of cardboard, so that was a loud sound. And then we got a coin, because a coin, coins are amazing, and we got a coin. If I imagine if there was a plush of, of rain from Sonic the Hedgehog, that would be the most ridiculous thing, but then we got a coin, which is kind of not that ridiculous, though, because, I don't know. And then we got the one-up mushroom. One-up mushrooms are epic, because green, green is one of my favorite colors, and Everything about the one mushroom is epic, and I don't know what company made that. So yeah, um, then we got one of the more recent plushies, um, a fire flower. There is like an ice flower out there, but it's not licensed, so this is the fire flower I have. So yeah. Um, then we got like almost like three superstars. Three. Three. So here's the small superstar. This good stuff superstar and the club mochi mochi small superstar. Three superstars. Three. How does this happen? I mean, I know how does this happen, but then we got the red turtle shell from Mario Kart. So yeah, um, I can use this in a Mario Kart video. And speaking of Mario Kart, here's a banana peel. So yeah, um, the banana peel was featured in Back to School Episode 2 because the teacher slipped on it. I, I need to stop plugging my videos because... No one wants to see a fucker. Now we have the last section, which is the Bowser Minion. Yay! Bowser Minions from the Despicable Me. No. But anyways, we have Bowser Minions. So first up, we have Goomba, the All-Stars Goomba. Um, there are some kind of Bowser Minions, so I'm gonna go quick with these. So if you're the All, you're the All-Star Goomba. Um, two, three Koopa Troopas. Here's the Golgi Koopa Troopa. And then over here we have two All-Star Koopa Troopas, so yeah, with their green shells. And speaking of Koopa Troopas, we have Koopa Paratroopas, so yeah. The Paratroopas here have nice wings. And then we also have um, the dead Koopa Troopa, Dry Bones. So it looks like he came back from the dead and ready to rise and kill people. Oh, this is gonna be a fuck this. Okay. That's, that's just me, me, the biggest, goofy person in the entire world. Here's a small Shy Guy. Um, Shy Guy is one of my favorite enemies because of his face. What is this guy? Shy Guy looks like he doesn't want to keep his face hidden from the world. Shy Guy is dream confirmed. But then we got, um, Thick Shy Guy. No, seriously, how on earth does someone make a Thick Shy Guy? At first, I thought this was legit, and I was like, how's this shy guy thick? And then I realized it's in our bootleg, so... I was stupid back then, okay? Shut up. Then here's Lakitu, which is one of my Christmas gifts back then, so yeah. Um, Lakitu is all... this is the all-stars one, I think. There's a spiny plush out there, I might get that spiny. It should be very cheap. Because one time I went on Amazon and it's probably cheap on Amazon. So here's the All Stars Bob Bomb. Again, Bob Bomb is probably one of my favorite Mario enemies because you know Bob Bombs are epic. And Goo is probably one. Of, Goo is probably my favorite enemy of all time. I don't know, but here's the fake Boo. Um, this Boo is like um, this tongue is oddly placed. Then we got um the. Sane Boo, I'm pretty sure this is Sane, or World of Nintendo, I can't tell. And then we got the All-Stars Boo, so yeah, um, the tag says so for itself, 2017 Nintendo, um, All-Stars Boo, this Boo is pretty cool, he's, he's so fluffy. Here's the Piranha Plant, um, so yeah, 
um, the Piranha Plant, we got the Piranha Plant Puppets! Yay! Piranha Plant Puppets are epic! And the Piranha Plant Puppet is so cool that I ended up with two! So, yeah, two Piranha Plant Puppets. <laughs> Here is the All-Stars Boy Bill! His hand! His hand came off! Um, Bullet, All Stars Bullet Bill's hand, um, it just snapped off, apparently. And then we got the All Stars Chain Chomp, which there was an accident a few days ago, or weeks ago. His chain came off, and we had to, um, glue it back on or something. I don't know what we did, but yeah, this is the Chain Chomp. And then we got All Stars Blooper from Mario Kart. I'm just showing these plushes randomly, so yeah, there's the. Platoon Squip. No, I'm just kidding, guys. Speaking of this, here's Cheap Cheap. This plush has, like, eyes, bright eyes, um, wings. What is this, a flying fish? Is this Flappy Bird? But yeah, this is Cheap Cheap. And then we have, um, this is, um, All Stars Kamek. Kamek has been featured in a tons of my videos. It's not tons of my videos, but many of my, in my videos. But you know why I honestly don't agree that a uh, plush I don't like this big fake Kamek. So we're taking his glasses. Oh my gosh, that just honestly don't look like Kamek's eyes. But the worst part is what's with the back? What is with the back? The back is is done a horrible job. Um, but then we got Wigwer. Um, the Wigwer is very long. Um, Wigwer is like. You know, long wave war. And the last mi Bowser Mini plush is Boom Boom. I will get Pom Pom pretty soon. And so, yeah, um, this is Boom Boom, All Stars 1. And let's see if is there any more plushies I forgot. Let's see. Yes, I have no, I have no plush missing. Yes. Joking around, but this is every Mario plush I own for 2022. It's, man, it's different. Like, seriously, it's, it's changed so much. Like, seriously, we have, like, a whole m a touch, I mean, a bunch of new items now. Um, so more Luigi, more Mario, um, more, more stuff. So, yeah, more stuff. But, yeah, um, if I do a 2023 plus collection, that would take me forever to show you every single one. But, you know what? I don't care. I do it for you guys. So yeah, this is every single one of my Mario Plus collections, and yes, I'm too lazy to count every single one. Cause yeah, um, there are some plushies hidden. Like you can't even see the Luigi hat. But yeah, um, what is that sound? Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I am so tired, so I have to. End, I'm gonna end this video right now, and and I'm gonna edit by tomorrow on December third. Okay, bye guys.